It gave us a first-hand experience of what astronauts go through before they go to space. It was a lot better than I expected. I thought it would be a bit more like learning rather than hands-on. It's got to be probably getting all together and working together to like achieve something. The science club was kind of been what I expected. It's really good. The club gave them the opportunity to do a lot of activities and visits to uh, sites such as Kinetic that they wouldn't have been able to do otherwise. In conjunction with the Sorrel Foundation, Kingston University hosted the first ever Science and Engineering Saturday Club. 36 13 to 15 year olds from 10 local schools joined us here at Kingston University on a 16 week programme exploring the journey into space where they explored the aspects of science, engineering and technology behind British astronaut Tim Peake's mission. Led by Kingston academic experts and a team of student ambassadors, club members got off to an explosive start, learning about rockets and propulsion, then building and launching their own crafts. In the weeks that followed, members discovered how an astronaut trains, the physical effects of space on the body and how food is prepared and water purified and they also discovered how space explorers adjust when they come back to Earth. Our adventure finished with a look at computing behind rocket navigation, programming of lunar robots, and the development of space flight games, plus their filming of special effects in our green screen suite. First Britain into space, Helen Sharman thrilled with stories of training, launch, time in the MIR space station, and life back on Earth. Whilst Tim Peake was beamed in to talk about his adventure, club members witnessed how Helen and other astronauts prepare for the G-force of launch thanks to Kinetic's demo spin of their human centrifuge and discovered how satellites that enable global communication are built thanks to the British Interplanetary Society, Alastair Scott. What was fantastic was to see all of these young persons who were interested and keen to get involved in whatever activity was thrown at them each Saturday. What inspired me the most was their dedication and willingness to get involved, especially out of their comfort zone for something like sports activities. Our student ambassadors had the opportunity to develop their transferable skills and also inspire them into different career avenues, perhaps considering more teaching or working with young persons. The Saturday Club has been a fantastic opportunity and exciting experience for everybody involved from the student ambassadors, the academics, and of course, the young people. We would like to thank the Sorrel Foundation, Kingston University, and our sponsors for making this opportunity. And we would hope to continue this in the future. I don't really know what I want to do in my future, but by doing Saturday Club, it's kind of urged me a bit more towards the science section rather than anything else. I was planning to be an engineer when I grew up, but now that I've seen it, I know which type I want to be and uh, how I can achieve it by going to Saturday Club. Um, I've always wanted to go into biology, so medicine particularly, and I was going to take chemistry on like a sideline, but now it's very much a race between um, physics and chemistry now because of the club. It's changed the way I view physics as like a whole, so engineering might be something that I want to do, I don't know.